everyone loves a good supercar. But the vehicles we've got for you today have moved a little beyond that category. The fastest cars in the world are now hypercars, many of which are from brands so expensive and exclusive, most people have never heard of them. So if you're tired of watching Ferraris and Lamborghinis claim to be the speediest vehicles on the roads, buckle up and enjoy this ride through the fastest cars in the world. Before we get started, make sure you hit that like button. Also, subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you can keep up to date with all our latest and most exciting content. Number 10, Bugatti Veyron Supersport. If you know anything about fast and expensive cars, you're probably familiar with the name Bugatti and their incredible feats of engineering. The Bugatti Veyron Supersport is just one of these marvelous vehicles. Capable of going from zero to 62, yes, 62 miles per hour in just 2.5 seconds, the Bugatti Veyron Supersport is ready to bring the heat. When you combine that with the insane top speed of 268 miles per hour, you very rapidly realize this is an astonishingly serious piece of automotive engineering. While it's easy to dismiss Bugatti as being nothing more than the plaything of overpaid rappers, you'd be dismissing over a hundred years of car manufacturing history. The Bugatti Veyron Supersport represents an incredible achievement in this lineage. Of course, with just 30 units lovingly made by hand and a two and a half million dollar list price, the Bugatti Veyron Supersport may be a little out of reach for most of us. Number nine, Hennessy Venom GT. If the Bugatti Veyron Supersport wasn't quite fast enough for you, the next car on our list might be of interest. The Hennessy Venom GT is a supercar turned hypercar with an interesting pedigree. Hennessy Performance is a Texas-based car tuning company, but the Venom GT is actually based off a British-made Lotus Exige chassis. Building off the incredible engineering of the Lotus and improving upon its performance, the Hennessy Venom GT is a seriously impressive bit of kit. It's capable of hitting an astonishing top speed of 270 miles per hour and goes from zero to 60 in just 2.5 seconds. All this speed isn't much good unless you do something with it. That's why the Hennessy Venom GT previously set the world record for the fastest two-seater sports car back in February of 2014. And while this has now been surpassed by several other cars, it's still an incredible achievement. Number eight, Koenigsegg Aguera RS. Next up is a European hypercar from a country that we don't usually look to for the fastest cars in the world. The Koenigsegg Aguera RS is a Swedish built beast of a car that crushes track times in style. A twin turbo V8 engine delivers 1400 horsepower, which allows the Koenigsegg Aguera RS to go from 0 to 60 in just 2.9 seconds. It boasts a jaw dropping 278 miles per hour top speed more than quick enough to outrun your neighbor's out. In order to achieve these astonishing speeds, the Koenigsegg Aguera RS boasts bodywork that's made completely of carbon fiber. As you can imagine, this means that any damages to the car are incredibly expensive to repair. The rear wing of the car can be worth over $300,000 alone, depending on spec. Only 25 units of the Koenigsegg Aguera RS were ever built. But despite the two and a half million dollar list price, they all sold out in just 10 months. That makes this one of the rarest cars ever made. Number seven, SSC Ultimate Aero. While this next car might look dated by today's standards, back in 2007, it was all the world of high performance drivers could talk about. The SSC Ultimate Aero is an American made hypercar, which you probably haven't heard of before. Claiming the Guinness World Record for fastest production car in September 2007, the SSC Ultimate Aero would go on to become a cult classic among petrol heads across the world. This interesting looking vehicle hit a record breaking top speed of 256 miles per hour. The SSC Ultimate Aero won't let you down on the speed front. While hypercars are generally considered to be a bit tricky to get the hang of, the SSC Ultimate Aero is prized for its superior handling, performance, and quality of ride. The SSC Ultimate Aero is relatively affordable by the standards of the other vehicles we've looked at so far. It comes in at a surprisingly reasonable $740,000. Number six, Hennessy Venom F5. 
While our next entry hasn't quite made it onto the roads yet, it boasts some serious specs and comes from a company that's managed to deliver the goods in the past. This is the Hennessy Venom F5. Announced back in 2014, a lot of careful work has gone into the design and engineering of the Hennessy Venom F5. It's absolutely clear that this car is aiming to be number one, regardless of the competition. This American-made Challenger to Bugatti and Koenigsegg claims that it will be able to reach top speeds of up to 311 miles per hour. That's all thanks to the planned 6.6-liter twin-turbo V8 engine that produces 1,817 horsepower. A price tag of $1.5 million places the Hennessy Venom F5 firmly in the Playthings for Billionaires category. But that's honestly what we expected. While it may still be conceptual, Hennessy promises us that the Venom F5 is on the way. We can't wait to see just what they do with it. Number 5. Bugatti Chiron Supersport If you thought the Bugatti Veyron was an impressive piece of supercar engineering, wait until you meet its bigger brother. The Bugatti Chiron Supersport is the dream car of thrill-seeking billionaires across the globe. A 16-cylinder, 8-liter engine produces 1,578 horsepower of pure brute force. It's this growling beast of an engine that allows the Bugatti Chiron Supersport to hit world record-breaking speeds and officially take its crown as the fastest car in the world with an astonishing 304 miles per hour top speed. Beyond the racing pedigree, the Bugatti Chiron Supersport is pure luxury on wheels. Every last detail is crafted with the finest attention to detail, and nothing has been overlooked. The Bugatti Chiron Supersport is an automotive icon and the flagship model of Bugatti's monumental line of hypercars, with a price tag to match. If you want to pick up one of these bad boys, it will set you back a cool $4 million. But you better hurry, there are only 30 units ever being produced. Number 4. Koenigsegg Jesko the all-new flagship vehicle from Koenigsegg, the Jesko disregards hypercars and claims a new and more impressive title of Mega Car. Under the hood is a 50-liter twin-turbo V8 engine that produces up to 1,600 horsepower when filled with E85 biofuel. With all that power comes a lot of performance, and the Koenigsegg Jesko can hit a seriously impressive 278 miles per hour top speed. However, Koenigsegg claimed that the Jesko is capable of breaking the world record and delivering 330 miles per hour of top speed, but this has yet to be proven. Taking on these kinds of speeds requires careful consideration of personal safety for the driver, so Koenigsegg aren't taking any chances while they prepare to try and claim the crown. Regardless of whether or not it's the fastest car in the world, the Koenigsegg Jesko sure packs in a lot of punch. It's also incredibly beautiful to look at. With the design so sleek, you might just wonder if it's even real. Number 3. Venom GT Spider Everyone likes cruising in a drop top on a warm summer's day, but the next car we've got for you might leave your hair more than a bit ruffled. The Venom GT Spider claims the title of fastest production convertible car ever made. The Venom GT Spider boasts some serious engine power, with its bi-turbo 7-liter V8 powerhouse. It produces 1,451 horsepower and can go from 0 to 60 in just 2.4 seconds. Beating world records is just in the Venom GT Spider's DNA. It's built by Texas-based Tennessee Performance, who have over 25 years of experience in the supercar building business. Hitting a top speed of 265 miles per hour, the Venom GT Spider claimed the Guinness World Record for the world's fastest convertible car. Combine that with the sleek looks of this Lotus-based automobile, and you've got a recipe for something truly amazing. All that power and prestige will cost you a pretty penny. The Venom GT Spider starts at $1.3 million for the base model. Number 2. SSC Tuatara Another pre-production car with some serious performance claims, the SSC Tuatara is America's answer to the Bugatti Chiron. Designed as the successor model to the world record-breaking SSC Ultimate Aero, the Tuatara has some big shoes to fill. SSC are confident in their ability to build another champion, and they pulled out all the stops to ensure that they hit another home run. The SSC Tuatara features a 5.9-liter twin-turbocharged V8 engine 
that can deliver 1,775 horsepower when running off E85 biofuel. SSC claims that the car will be able to hit speeds of well over 300 miles per hour, but there's no definite top speed to clock just yet. If you want to get your hands on an SSC Tuatara, you better get your name on the wait list fast, though. They're only going to produce 100 units of this incredible hypercar. The list price is unknown, but having seen the technology behind this, we'd expect it to be well over $2 million. Number 1. Devil 16 If you've ever been to Dubai, you'll know full well that people there love their expensive cars and have the means to afford some of the fastest and highest performing automobiles on the planet. The Devil 16 is a pre-production hypercar that's actually designed and built in Dubai. Devil has got some pretty impressive claims to make about the 16, and they allege that once the production car is finalized, it will be able to reach a top speed of over 320 miles per hour, well in excess of any other hypercar on the market today. There's a 16-liter engine under the hood that produces an absolutely insane 2,000 horsepower from the base spec model, and going up to a mind-boggling 5,007 horsepower in the upgraded model. All this will set you back a fairly steep $2.2 million if the Devil 16 finally makes it to the market. While we don't know if we'll ever see the Devil 16 make it to production, we do know that it would completely change the game if it was able to perform as well as its advertised specification. And that's the fastest cars in the world. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. That's it for now.